All right, so listen, that was the Vet 48. Yee. Yeah. All the way live, all the way live, all the way. We got to switch. We got to switch our drinking word now. But we got right. well, before you do it, right. we can do it when you get there. Damn right. We're going to swing us. Swing. Swing. Oh, shit. I knew, we got a new one for y'all. We, hey, we, right. we love when the ladies on here. We love when the ladies on here. We, 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 yeah. we should have made sure Remy wasn't here. Well, that's the favorite. We like when the ladies are here. It's always like when the ladies are here. But I, I, yeah, I, I, but I, the, I love it anyway. But the ladies love when Remy here. No, they don't. Fuck me being on. They don't even be on the shit. What the hell? I'm kind of cute. Excuse me. 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 So I they love me here too. I'm just so proud of you. Can you play that that laughter track? <laughs> <laughs> From that bitch. Anyways, fuck the dumb shit. It's gonna be a Oscar, man. Y'all welcome. Treat the cheap in this bitch, man. All right. Yeah. 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 Listen, 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 listen. I've been trying to get you on the show since 1980. <laughs> so I've been a fan. She has been talking about music. I've been a fan of you rapping in your car. <laughs> I was like, this chick is ill. She got like a pretty thug thing going. We got to get her on the show. And then one day, really, it's like, I was in the studio and I met this girl. Nate. I said, what the fuck I've been saying? No, 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 no. <laughs> let, me, let, me, let me rewind you back, right? I go to the studio. Shout out Vince, he in here with us too, y'all uh, on yeah, the camera. Yeah, yeah. All right, Long, Long. But that's our producer and engineer. Long, Long. Yeah, Long. So, so, you know, I work with Vince and we in there and he like, man, I want you to hear my artist, Trio. And when he said it, it was like, ding. And I was like, why can't you hear his name, Trio? <laughs> She's not lying. She's been talking about you forever and ever and ever. So when I went to the studio and then I heard Vince bring your name up, I'm like, Oh, I done heard his name before. I done heard his name before. But he didn't know I had already booked you. See, I be doing shit. Right. I be, so, I be doing this, shit by myself sometimes. Yeah, yeah. she's she good for doing that. Me. Listen, we have made this pack in the new year that I wasn't going to book nobody on the show no more unless she it's all three But true, you know why? Because she'll have low smoke on and What's Joe, that? Joe, <laughs> we know. And, and then she'll call me. She'll be like, Remy, you ever heard of Joe Smoker? I'm like, who? <laughs> okay. wait, wait, wait. But he come on the show and then we listen to his music and we like, and then she always got this. Whack. He, been, he was recording listen, in the yeah. bathroom. Listen, but she wasn't listening to the Everybody can't make it to love. Somebody can't get the love. Oh, he popping, and then I go on his IG, and he got thirty followers, and I'm like, <laughs> really, Trina? <laughs> you send that shit in my email, and it sound like that bitch records that. <laughs> <laughs> That's the show you miss. Yeah. So I told, I told Trina, I said, look, we gotta have a screening process. Now everybody can't get in front of the big camera. Yeah, for real. But she, but she <laughs> built you by herself. She did a great job. She did a great job. She's gotten a lot better now. I mean, everybody. I think this was a great choice. Yeah. I'll yeah, be trying to get everybody. I'll be trying to get everybody a chance. Okay. Yeah, the niggas in front of the camera, man. I don't know. I don't know they. I don't know that they always mix and match it up the toilets until they can. You see what I'm saying? I don't know. I don't know until they can. It's a rock play. I'm like, what the fuck? That was before she was fully doing homework. That was right. Right. That's before we used to make my daughter do the homework. Oh, yeah. And look, <laughs> and to make matters worse, you know how my man got his music all coded and everything, and we was able to Shazam this joint. Uh -huh. These artists? No. <laughs> ain't, ain't no, ain't no, ain't no Apple music. No, 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 Semi-colon, backslash, backslash. It was called Mixtapes Master. Yeah, man, I'm talking about, man. He was like, you can go to my cousin's house and hit it. Oh, <laughs> I said, what, your cousin house? So, like, they, they playing up at Lookers this week. I'm like, what's oh, at Lookers this week? Nah, but it's good, it's good having artists like yourself that come in front of the camera and come kick it with us. I'm going to tell you, I, when the first time I met you, it was like, damn, I like your energy. I love your group. Before I met you, I heard the music. Vince let me hear the music. Yeah, yeah. 
I told him, I was like, I didn't even think he was from town. Like, I'm like, where's she from? Cause I'm like, Virginia, DC, or Maryland, or somewhere on the East Coast. And I'm like, oh, she from right here. I'm like, damn, that's crazy. Yeah, a lot of people say that. Yeah. Oh, a lot of people say they don't think I'm from Tampa. Yeah, I mean, because your wordplay is like, it, it's just everything. The, the beat select, the track selection, your wordplay, the way you come on the tracks, it just, it don't put me in the mind of Tampa music. Mm -hmm. Who you on battle rap with me? But there's so many listen, there's so many genres of music and there's so many genres and not all of us not all I said all of us like I'm really an artist. Um, <laughs> not all artists fall in that cookie cutter. That's you see true. what I'm saying? Yeah. My thing is that it kind of reminds me of like that out of the box. Like I remember the first time I ever heard of Lady Rage, Lady of Rage. She didn't fit that cookie cutter. Right. You know what I mean? She didn't fit and that. She don't, she don't do your vibe like Lady Ray. Yeah, she does. That's Actually, why I use when, Lady Ray. It, it, it literally was when it was just now playing. I was like, damn, that's what they were having. Well, that the first time I, I heard it. Bring it up. Turn it on. The first time I had heard her music, and then last week when she had, last week she dropped her she dropped her EP, and she's one of the EPs that got played throughout the weekend and stuff like that. And you can always tell because. If I, if I fuck with something, I go a little fucking crazy on Instagram. Yeah, you did. Promoting it. I, I was like, yeah. I was like, because one of the songs must have did something. It must have did something. One of the songs do something. You know what I mean? Like, that's a game. You're like, what? You know what I mean? Me and, my, me and my niece running around the house, we cleaning up, we playing with little little sticks and shit. She's like, what? Like, what? She's going to be on the show, though. Yeah. Like, she's going to be on the show, though. Yeah. Like, she's going to be on the show, though. Yeah. She's going to be on the show, though. Yeah. 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 You know what? Is she fine? Is she fine? Because I just went out of the studio yesterday and she was there just kicking and chilling with them for a little bit. And just she's that real, just down to earth, homie type girl. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, you know, they in there playing Mortal Kombat and, you know, we just sitting there. You got to see the bitch ass. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> 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 Since she was kicking his ass, I think the, 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 new, the new drink word is yeah. definitely massacre. We go to a massacre. Oh, what is it? Massacre. So whenever she massacre something, okay. I'm like, y'all know y'all not taking a sip now. We on motherfucking rampage. Train the way she doing this beat. Mm. Massacre that bitch. Oh, yeah. Some, some bitch. Uh, you know so what how I mean? you met Vince? How y'all linked up? Like that's, that's like okay. a Timberland and it, it, the, the 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 chemistry is crazy, man. Y'all got a real good chemistry. So mm -hmm. how did that come? Well, I met Vince through like I really somebody else told me about Vince. Somebody else told me about the lava pit. Just to, like you know, suggesting a good studio. I was already looking for like a, a produce already because. I knew I wanted to get a project together, but I need to find somebody perfect enough to do something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so like, I was already looking for studios. I ended up like booking this the first time. After the first time, well, first I was just recording over other people's uh, instruments. Right? You know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah. I was just recording, just going to the studio. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? I could tell by like Vince, like energy, you know what I'm saying? How he is as a person, he's good vibe. He, he right. gave me feedback. That's something that all artists love for. Right. You know what I'm saying? He's he good on that, you know what I'm saying? His communication is great. He's a good person overall. Right. Like, so kind of, we just kind of like, yeah, yeah, so we kind of just, nah, he ain't no yes man. Yeah, but that's easy. Some people let you know that shit works. Listen, I think we need to rewind that shit. That shit fold more time. That's a good spirit, man. Exactly. And he make you feel at ease, like, Sometimes it can be enough pressure when you're in the in the booth recording. You make you feel at ease at yeah. home. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You go in there, you be like, you want to light up one before we start. You know what I'm saying? It's just kind of like yeah. the bar just kind of just like kind of grew. You know what I'm saying? Over right. time, you know what I'm saying? Just kind of happened with people. With those people that you know, what I'm you just can't. The chemistry just kind of just like went there, and it just became like more than music at that point. Right. And music being involved, it just became like. It just it was just made with love more than so like business. You know what I'm saying? That's real. That's like, what's up. Friends. It's so dope that you. It's so dope that you said that because uh, Missy said something like that recently about her and Timberland. She said it was like that marriage that I never asked for. And she said when they would get in the studio together, it was just like something just happened. And I think about you know how Timberland always kind of throw it outside the box. So it's really important for that relationship with the artist and the producer, engineer. That's a very special relationship. It's a bond that you know what I mean. It's a bond that. Is unspoken of. It is very rare that people actually come here and talk about that yeah, yeah. and yeah. talk about that kind of stuff. Right. But it's a dopeness, and my thing is that 
sometimes they can pull something out of you, something you don't even know that's inside of you. Right. You know what I mean? So tell us about this new project. You just dropped the last Friday. Yeah. So look, yeah, I just dropped, you know what I'm saying, the Decade, the EP, just dropped the last Friday. Uh, what I like to say most about the project is like, it's like, it's all over the place, you know what I'm saying? Like, you ain't gonna hit just one thing, you know, hit just one sound, like, yeah. you know what I'm saying? It ain't just straight hip-hop, you know what I'm saying? It's not yeah, just it's straight, hip-hop, 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 hip-hop. Yeah, exactly. right. you know what I'm saying? Not the same thing you're gonna hear from, like, any other rap artist, you know what I'm saying? I like to say it about myself, you know what I'm You can just listen to the EP and you would say it as your damn self. I don't gotta right. say it, you know what I'm yeah. saying? And it's just like, another thing, once again, it was made out of love, we did this shit for real. Like, you know what I'm saying? We do this in a rush, we didn't, we didn't rush it. You know what I'm saying? We did this because it's like, we did this out of love, you know Because it's something that we really wanted to do. You, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so it's just kind of unexplainable. Like, it's just, and it's my first project, my first big project. That's project your baby, yeah. So, so it's like, that's your baby. It's a lot to me, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? It, it was done with Vince, you know what I'm saying? So, so it, it was even more greater, like, you know what I'm saying? That I got to do it with such great people, you know what I'm saying? All the time. It was yeah. just fucking amazing. I don't I can know. Tell you this. He, this was excited about the project. I never really seen him light up or be as excited about <laughs> something he was involved in. Like, for real. Like, yeah. I've been recording Vince for a while and then I don't ever, I don't never remember Vince playing like really other remember. artists that he's like produced for. And I know, you, I know you're not the first, <laughs> yeah, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Not, but yeah. your project, he was very excited about it. So, but you can hear it, you can hear it in the music. It's like, yeah. it's real fresh. Is new. It's it's just it's something that I think the game needs. You yeah. know what I'm and, and what I like about it is that it, it told a story, but it was like sometimes when you went to the next track, you had to double back. I had to double back on my iPhone because I had it playing through the speaker, and I was in the bathroom cleaning the bathtub. <laughs> and I had to double back because I thought the music had switched over <laughs> to a different artist because my music I have them. I, I'm random. So I don't catalog. I don't catalog it. I don't put it in play. Yeah. You know how some people put their music in play. Uh-huh. I do. Okay, but I have me to because music creates certain moves. So no, but me when it happened, you fucking. Fuck I was just trying to have you fucking. Yep, fucking listening to some R. Kelly in the next moment. But no, I knew he But no, but I knew that. I knew that the project was seven tracks, and I knew I hadn't heard seven female tracks back to back. But I, I, I'm telling you, I was on my, I was on my knees scrubbing my bathtub, and I was like, "Oh, that's somebody else. She gotta have somebody. This is, this is not the same." I had got my big ass up off the floor, walked all the way. I it took me about thirty you know, <laughs> She had to do a rolling, rolling, you know, you know, you know, you know, you know, these knees. They ain't like they, they ain't like they used to be. You know, I know them. What was that? You know, these knees are forty-threes. I hold on to the toilet. Whoa, <laughs> <laughs> so, ten minutes later when I got up, <laughs> seven songs later, <laughs> I had to re-loop it to the song. But I had got up and I went and I was like, oh shit, like she switched up her style. Like, it's like, damn, that reminded me of like, then I was in see, then it went from Lady of Rage. And I was like, that's some old Eve shit. When Eve first came out, Mm-hmm. Eve on that I don't know if y'all remember the Scorpion project when she came out on the that Scorpion was one of my project. Projects, but yeah. that's one of her, you know, that was her second project. Yeah, right. One of the best, one of but the it's one of her the best. First, first one was classic, but that Scorpion was dope. That she first project first was classic, but shit. it reminded me of that's who it, it put me in the mindset of. Yeah. I was like, shit, that's like some Eve shit. The way she flipped it, and I was like, damn. I said, okay, all right, all right. And then me and my niece, my niece we just listened to it all day. We had nothing better to do. That's real. No, don't tell me. Tell me where you can go check out Decade. Where you can go get it? I can go get it everywhere. Like, my own song, you know what I'm saying, it kind of convinced me. So I feel like I did a great job. 
I love the song. It just feel like I'm a storyteller. You know what I'm saying? I like yes. to feel like that. You know what I'm saying? Yes. I like to do that. That's making you feel like you're talking Absolutely. about something. That's a lost yeah. art. That's a lost storytelling. That's yeah. a lost art. Yeah. You know what I mean? Uh, I, I remember first when you when you start like I'm a Taurus, so one of the mm-hmm. things underlying things about Taurus is that they have this unexaturated they just need of music yeah. all the time. It is regardless of what, what kind of music it is or whatever. Yeah. But my thing is the art of storytelling and the first time I really understood the art of storytelling was um the boy with the patch over his eye. You did you just said a boy with a patch? Yeah, that was so disrespectful. No, that's not what I said. She said, my boy. My boy with the patch on his eye. No, I didn't get a mind. You know what I mean? She said that boy with the patch over his eye. I was going to say, that's so disrespectful. Anyway. She was not talking about fat wall. Well, yes. Wow. I'm glad you didn't say nobody with a patch on his eye. I'm glad you didn't say nobody with a patch on his eye. I'm glad you didn't say nobody with a patch on his eye. No, but it was the first, I can remember when his project came out, I remember children's story. It was one of those things that, um, I don't know if you're, you know, back then we were still on tapes, but I remember, like, take going up there, take my little money up there and buy the tape. And I remember playing it, and I remember my mama coming and destroying my motherfucking tape. Wow. You because tried, they they tried to so. put your tape back right? No, because she heard the lyrics. She heard the cursing and the lyrics and stuff like that. You cursed the Jews, Lord? Oh, no. Which, well, no, I'm talking about the album. The album, the whole album, was that sticker oh, wow. album? I was fighting. Really? I don't mean, even remember Curse Rose in that album, but. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes, oh, he did. That's how Mona Lisa. That's the one she was playing. That's why she was playing. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's one of my favorite things on that. No, but he did Curse on the album. And my mom, she was one of those, she wasn't those, one of those whatever. But yeah. I remember going out and repurchasing it. Because my thing was the art of storytelling. Right. And that, to me, that soul is missing. Right. And music. Nobody really tells a story. If I want to hear a good story, I got to go check out J. Cole, Kendrick Lamar. True. Who is your so, favorite artist? Those kind of artists. Uh, well, right. female. It doesn't matter. It's not really wrong. That's not uh, okay, wrong. Right. Well, I, I, I listen to a lot of people. Yeah, actually. So. Give us three. But, well, give us your three top well, artists. Well, I, I say the most people that's play on my playlist is uh, Lil Snoop. Love Snoop, R.I.P. Nipsey, R.I.P. Yeah, then R.I.P. Nipsey. Damn, I wouldn't have expected you to say Lil Snoop. Like, I'm just saying, Lil Snoop. 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 City girls or something. Who wants to say city girls? Get your ass up. You know you violent. Like, like, that's what I mean. She's like, I asked her to throw three shots. She's like, so not Tim. Yeah, but you know what? Jazz is very mu- musically inclined. Okay, right? but she didn't even say city girl. Right. I, I wouldn't no, expect that. City. City jazz put me on some artists that. Mm-hmm. Y'all probably never heard of before, and these artists are so dope. I'm like, damn, yeah, Jess, how you find out about them? Like, she, uh, she was like the podcast. Her musical IQ was like through the roof. Yeah, yeah. this is a new thing. Really. But everybody, like, City Girls, come on, man, that's a gimmick. I know. Yeah. But, yeah. I mean, but you'll be amazed. It's a lot of, like, like so, <laughs> they, be, they be going sideways. So, who's your third one? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we got Nipsey, um, we got uh, so, 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 I don't know. I listen, um, somebody put me on this. But he cool. I listen to Young Thug too. Thug, Thug is dope. Yeah, yeah. Thug is very dope. Thug, I'm, 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 gonna you, I'm gonna tell you like this here. A lot of people get caught up in the. No, no, I listen to. They get, they get caught up in the. He's a massacre. But when you, but if you oh, ever just yeah. zone out, if you ever just zone out and yeah. listen yeah. to Thug, man, that boy like. Sh- he, some of these songs, some of these songs, you can listen to them like damn. Like that first hit game, that, that first hit game, he like got some more on the show. I'm telling you, man. He's but but now, now I'm, I'm gonna tell you because if you if you really fuck with other like that, you know other can really flow. Like yeah. he can really spit, and that would blow me because I heard a song where he didn't sound like the the auto tune and yeah. the uh, and all I mean, that. That's 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 the him I don't listen to. Though. That's the one that kind of can get irritated. Yeah, but if you ever listen to him like really just rap. I was like, damn, he can really rap. Yeah, Go back and, just, and see the lyrics written yeah. down on paper. He really be saying like, yeah, man, yeah. he hit a song with T.I. It ran about the money. Yeah. Yeah, I went back and, and see when he when he actually wrote. I was like, oh, this it, is actually took, it took for uh, my 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 good good. I call him my brother, but a friend of mine, uh, DJ Cash Money. He the one who actually 
told me, you know what I'm saying, about Thugger, he was like, look, I'm going I'm to send you some Thugger songs to listen to. Not what you probably done heard on the radio yeah, before. Yeah. And when I listened to him, I was like, damn, I got to look at him a little bit different because he really got yeah. some content. Yeah. You know, he got some shit. He got a whole lot of inventory, so it's kind of, and, and nobody, you know what I'm saying, probably don't, unless somebody put in a good word, nobody gonna go and look up right. all yeah. the sound and yep. stuff like that, you know what I'm saying, but he got some, you know what I'm saying, yeah. and he got some good stuff in there. Yeah. That's real. So, yeah. All right, well. Oh, I don't care what y'all say about y'all. <laughs> oh, you can't get past his look. That, 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 that's what you're calling. Uh, you know, my thing is that anybody that looked for us popping part of the mind. <laughs> you just mad because he, he fit in that seat, that purple dress so good. That's what it was. And, you know, <laughs> and anybody that wear their hair braided up like it just got finished getting washed. Oh, he's talking about his personal stuff. Yeah. 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 I don't give you yeah. anybody yeah. about yeah. Yeah. I don't give you anybody about <laughs> yeah, just listen to him. What's she saying? That she, she, yeah, he's not celebrating. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, my thing is, what's somebody else on the list that we can sold? <laughs> <laughs> Y'all traded him in for somebody. Like, <laughs> you know what I'm like, I'm like Dave Chappelle. You know what I mean? When they try to get rid of old old DB, uh, he got to go. Uh, <laughs> Tell the people about the, uh, the decade, like the meaning behind it. I, I mean, you okay. told it to me, but they don't know. Like, what's yeah, yeah. Okay, so uh, decade, really. So I made my first song. Well, I have like, you know, I, I have proof that I made my first song at 10. It really was seven, but I don't have that song, so I can't prove it. But I made my first song when I was 10. I'm 20 now. So, oh no! Yeah, so right now. So, right now. So, right now. Okay, it's, it's so been a few 10 years it's since I made my first song. You know what I'm saying? So, that's, so that's why I call it decade. Listen, so, that makes it even dope yeah. because, right. you know what? There's no way up. There's no way to go one up right. at this point. Yeah. And my thing is that I can remember. Okay, I'm 43 now. <laughs> <laughs> so, but that's I a couple decades. <laughs> that's a couple of decades ago. <laughs> but I can remember at 20 how hungry I was. So that hunger is going to make sure she get it. Yeah. Absolutely. You see how it? Sarah, Sarah, you got to drop some music now. Yeah, we got to no, I don't record. currently have no. anything. But you, you got one you want to play? Give me a minute. I can find it. She something. gave us three tracks. New trend, G Man. Something new. Tell us about something new. Something new. Uh, that right now. That one right now. I don't. I don't. Look, that one. I went to Vince and I said, man. I want you. I want. I want. I want to write a song, but this time, you know, so I want to go in. I want to go in. I want to talk my shit. And I want you to. I want you to make some shit. You know what I'm saying? And he just off from scratch. He just started making a beat. And I was like, okay. Also, oh, Vince is okay. like. So yeah. Vince is making the beat. Vince That's what he's saying. Every single thing on the EP. Every beat should be on that EP. That's real. Okay, okay, one, okay. One, don't talk to me like I'm not drunk. <laughs> 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 Trina, where you been? Vince is making beats. Like, what you talking about? Okay, one, I'm not slow. Okay, two, I'm not slow. Okay, three, I'm not slow. Okay, four, I'm not slow. Okay, five, I'm not slow. Okay, six, I'm not slow. Okay, seven, I'm not slow. Okay, eight, I'm not slow. Okay, nine, I'm not slow. Okay, ten, I'm not slow. Okay, eleven, I'm not slow. Okay, twelve, I'm not slow. Okay, thirteen, I'm not slow. Okay, fourteen, I'm not slow. Okay, fifteen, I'm not slow. Okay, sixteen, I'm not slow. Okay, seventeen, I'm not slow. Okay, eighteen, I'm not slow. Okay, nineteen, I'm not slow. Okay, twenty, I'm not slow. Okay, twenty-one, I'm not slow. Okay, twenty-two, I'm not slow. Okay, twenty-three, I'm not slow. Okay, twenty-four, Right. Let's uh, talk about the song. We're going to the table down. We're going to bring Vince up. Yeah. The giant going to talk to me like, I don't know what we're doing. Yeah, hey, man. Let's get into the trip. Let's get into the trip. Hey, fuck that man. Hey, hey. 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 Hey.
say I'm with my chest. They say I'm a dog, but I'm sick with the best. Laughing at these niggas, but they see me as a threat. And I'm absolutely nothing like a mother still blessed. I'm still with the government, I'm nothing in the area. How about we put the gun down, take a break from burial? You might see me with a bitch or two, but I'll never marry one. Put that room on and she get out of this area. I know that you heard about me, I heard about me too. I know that they told you I be spitting on the truth. But did they ever tell you I'm nothing you do so? So anything I bring to the table, baby. This need to be on the next supply and demand. Headbuster is putting together the so supply and demand. Yeah. He's going to drop another one in September. Yeah. And I know if I'm in his ear hard enough. And get this on a few places. I know so it's time. Like, I don't. I, but see, he's, he's using all new songs. Right. For yeah, yeah. So he's probably going to want to get with you, and he's probably going to want to get with Lama, and he's probably going to want to get the studio, and he's probably going to want to get with Lama. I ain't shit wrong with that. Yeah, that's good. He's probably like this. I'm speaking like this, my shit. Ain't nothing wrong with that. He's probably going to want, but. Definitely, we gonna forward this over. Okay. Yeah, I appreciate my it. thing That's is real. this. My yeah. thing is this. I've heard a lot of female rappers here in Tampa. And I ain't heard nothing and like that. Nothing Me either, like man. That. I don't know. And my thing is, and my thing is, collaborate with because there are. If you really, if you cut the grass, right? This is something my mama told me. If you cut the grass and the snakes are exposed, you'll see who's not for you. You see what I'm saying? There's some. There's some. Well, I don't really fuck with too many female rappers in Tampa other than Mahogany. <laughs> uh-huh. Nah, you know oh, well, she ain't, in, she ain't in Tampa no more, but go ahead. Other than Mahogany? No, no, no. I ain't talking about Mahogany. Mahogany. I was going oh. to speak on somebody else. But oh, okay. Yeah, but other than Mahogany right now, that's you got to remember that. That's the yeah, she's, she's, she's definitely no <laughs> Yeah. But my thing is that that's a, whole, that's a whole other unique sound going on. It is. You know what I mean? And my thing is that I'm, I become a fan every day. Every day somebody sends music to the podcast. And every day I become a fan of somebody new. But that's dopeness. My thing is, I ain't seen that kind of wordplay and I ain't seen that kind of game. That's a breath of fresh air. It seemed uh, effortless, too. Like, when you listen to it, it sounds like you're not trying. Like, it's yeah, fun. I'm not. Yeah, I'm not. Like, it's yeah. too easy. Yeah, it's too easy. Yeah, yeah. 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 It's too easy. I promise you. And and, <laughs> is there anybody that you got on your charts that you want to work with, like, as far as a feature? Um, Speak it up, cause yeah. it might yeah. happen after they see this show. You talking about the temple? Yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, like okay. I mean, preferably um, we would like give, to give us Tampa, and then give us Tampa, and then give us. Okay, yeah. so temple wise, let's see. I would work. I would most definitely. I uh, want to work with um. Uh, oh shit! I think Clark Creek would do some hot. You know, yeah, yeah. I think Clark Creek would make a nice. 
Well, yeah, I, I, you know. In my head, I'm sitting here like, you ask her the question, I'm sitting here like, Creep. <laughs> Pusha Preen, yeah. because Pusha Preen was on a whole other side of the fucking. Well, that's his thing. I can't name all of them at one time. Pusha Preen was at her listening party. Yeah, he was. Yo, he Pusha, so crazy love. Pusha's yeah. my dude. I feel yeah. like I birthed him. <laughs> <laughs> I'm actually about to network. I'm finna um, get you on know, track with him too. Yeah, really. Well, Pusha yeah. is really dope, and I and I and I like anybody that's outside of the box. But it's not Pusha's time. Push the head's time. It's about you. Right. All right. <laughs> so give us your three artists, your three okay. type of artists you want to work with. Yeah. So, I would most definitely work with like, it's so hard to like think of them off the top, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody gonna get offended, like, you can always add later. <laughs> okay, well, well, she said she just named it three. Okay, well yeah, Mulani is one of them actually, she is like, you know, we working on that, we supposed to work on that. That'd be a dope so hopefully, we can have that on us. I would like to work with her, she's, she's, she's cool. Um, Jay Creek, yeah, you know what I'm saying? He, his music is actually great. I listen to a few of his songs too, you know what I'm saying? He, he's versatile as well. He got a good ass sound, you know what I'm saying? Right. So I want to, you know, he's a good person to work with. Um, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't know about the tempo, but we can go outside of that. Um, right. Let's see. So, well, first I want Beyonce, you know what I'm saying? I want Beyonce to come out, you know what I'm saying? I want Beyonce to come out. I see that whole part too. I see that whole part too. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I see that whole part too. Yeah, exactly. Hey, yo, B, you I'm seen this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I, I don't think we had one artist yet talk about B. And what so listen, and that's what we're going to do when we put it up. We're just going to start yeah. hashtagging B. We're going to tag it. I can hear her on the Let Go Remix right now. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
Listen, <laughs> because, because my thing is that it's a lost. Listen, hip hop has gotten so lost. Yeah. The battle, the actual freestyle, everything is written at this point. So my thing is that she was just going on the top of the dump. I, I'm from New York. I'm, I'm a Brooklyn baby. Uh -huh. So that that's the culture I come from. So when I see it, I recognize it. You know what I mean? Yeah. And my thing is that here in Tampa is a lot of times I'm sitting there listening to art freestyle and stuff like that, and I'm sitting there like I heard I, that last week. I said I heard that last week. <laughs> I heard you did that shit right at the I cipher. heard down on the SoundCloud. <laughs> I was at the cipher. You said the same shit. You had that same opening. <laughs> oh, that was the same shit. But I that's that. true story. We're not lying. I, I, come that, funny. I come from that lo that lost art. I come from that lost art. So, Weir, what is the next step? What is the next step? We got the single. I was pushing the single. You got to, I see you out there cutting. I see you doing videos. Okay, oh, hold on a second. Before we go too far, we gotta move the table down. And we gotta bring the man with the plan in. Yeah. <laughs> so I'm gonna, be so I'm gonna move the table this way. We gonna switch. Yeah. We gonna move it this way. Slide to the right. Okay. Slide to the right. And he gonna bring his chair yeah. over there to the end. We gotta fold him right down. Fold him right down. Are you good? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right. The man with the plan. The man with the plan. So, 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 so first, is you gonna let us know? She she let us know that she massacred you. Massacred. On the game, sister. I mean, she tried to take it back, but oh. ain't nobody else hear that. So I just I just want to know. Can you move that? No, no, no. Can you check to make sure everybody's in the shop? <laughs> Thank you. Listen, we just doing a whole school. Everybody in the shop? I ain't gonna love us. Thank you, because you know what I mean? We don't know where our video output is. <laughs> well, our camera guy. His birthday this week. I intern. His birthday this week, so we're going to social, social media people. They all gone. That's all right. The application will take an application. <laughs> all right, so tell them about the studio that where it matters at, because love Remy is like love the biggest spokesperson. Every time you turn around, lava, 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 and you think there's no other studio. Yeah, man, we, uh, me and uh, Remy, we've been, we've been doing this for how many years now? Yeah, a few now. I mean, Remy's old, yeah. so how many yeah, years? Yeah, whatever, you? man. <laughs> <laughs> All the records I did that y'all heard lately from, from Remy, 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 from
now there's a, a I forgot some kind of law or something that they're trying to put in place for producers saying that if you lease a beat for 200 bucks, but it end up being a hit single, that they can actually come back and like recoup yeah. Uh, residuals yeah, off the royalties off of it. Yo, when I saw that shit, when I saw that shit, I was hit the floor. I was like, you do. And you paid 250 for that beat, it's man. It's a lease. Yeah, see, man, it's like, even with yeah, this, I guess on a lease, yeah. If I sell a beat to an artist, you know, I, I don't do leasing, it's just gonna be exclusive, but I got some permission. And right. my name is gonna be on the track, and I'm gonna get something on the back end. Yeah. Only right. you get the track. I don't sell it to the that's same good. Beat to 100. Well, that's good. Right. See, and that's why we got spreadsheets. Right. Exactly. <laughs> no, because a lot of artists don't know. Right. Yeah. And that's the same thing. That's the thing. Listen, a lot of artists no. don't know. She over here looking at this damn dental bam. <laughs> 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 he keeps saying split sheets, but it's like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's not as fucking you up. <laughs> 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 I'm going to split like this. But it's not split sheets. You know what that is, right? Yeah. When she said split sheets. No, you talking about this thing right here? No. Split sheets is the yeah. sheet oh, yeah. where. <laughs> It's what it's, it's what the well, no, I kind of what you talking about music. Yeah, 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 about, yeah, yeah. Okay. Just, uh, oh, okay. Like that. <laughs> okay, she keep fucking with me. Well, okay. yeah, hold on, like, what the hell? What the <laughs> 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 she she used every time. Not this. This shit will fuck you up. This shit will fuck you up. Don't make no deals on this shit. But my thing is that a lot of artists don't know, and then my thing is that like a lot of artists, and I'll be like, yo, well, send me the track, and they be like, it's on Spotify. I'm not going to Spotify. Listen to your music. You trying to get on my podcast? Right. I need you to send, send it us to the me. link. Right. Send us the link because after you leave, I'm going to take that music and I'm going to put it on the on the website so it can be a rotation. So yeah. after a while, that rotation and stuff like that, we can get you some streams. And that's what, that's what we're planning to do with the podcast is to have a pretty much like a radio service for our artists. So yeah. that way we can have artists that submit their music and we can play them. We can have a, a, a section on there that plays your music. People can go there and click the link, download it, whatever. But you get monetization. That does not include that shit that you record in the bathroom. Right. I can't. I'm not here to lie. I can't right. attach that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, we're giving you. I'm out there looking to see who raised your toilet. Because I'm going to tell you right now, 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 I'm going to tell you right and that's, oh, and that's Tabor. Uh, that snatching and that um. Oh, this whole snatching. That's my song. Yeah. 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 But if you yeah. listen, yeah. that's my song. If you listen, if you listen, if you listen, if you listen, 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 listen to the real life snatching, I don't know another word. It sounded sound like snatching was recorded in this room, like. But the it's song, bad, went, it, the it. song went crazy. Was I was gonna say triple X. Oh, he's trying to sound like a I'm so mad when this bitch said he put a cowboy on a cowbell. Listen, all you gotta do is put a cowbell on a cowbell with a loud So with that quality, they got played in the club, or he got what? it got played on the radio. That's how we heard it. Wow. Yes. I don't know if he ever went back and remastered it. No, he had to remaster. No, I'm going to pull up snatch. Pull up the original snatch. He never remastered snatch. Never remastered. Never remastered. Never remastered. No. no. Well, I, oh, about Antico. a year, about two, Antico, the real about two years ago, I went to show our friend that's not our friend no more. Mm -hmm. Well, not my friend, still your friend. So I, went, <laughs> I, went, I went to show him what juke music was. Okay. And to me, whenever I think juke music, I think Tampa Tony, I think Tay Bebe. So I went to show him, and then that's what Kiki had in the split in the street. And we was out there, we was listening to, the we was listening to the Tico, and I said, It was mine in the street. I said, this shit sound like, it was recorded in the bathroom. It looked like, and I said, and, I, and, and, and this motherfucker had a million God knows how many fucking Hey, Vince, that was the first time I ever, I ever, ever, ever seen a record recorded in this modern age that had that quality. It sounded like literally they had probably went in a bedroom, had a mic stand, and the engineer probably was sitting right next to him. And you said they had no mattress. It was, the it was yeah, they had an air mattress. But, but, air but mattress. the song was so the, the rawness of it and what he was saying on it, it was so raw and so good. What was so raw about they it? Left, they left, they left, they, 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 they recorded whatever okay, they did on scene and we're they gonna, went right to the club. We're gonna stop now, we're gonna stop now. They got played in the club. He made that shit sound like it took off. The words of the song, if the head and the pussy good girl. That's sometimes that's all it takes, sex sales. Nigga, that's what I'm talking about. Nigga, that's what I'm talking about. 
was. We don't know what cool dick was. told us what cool dick was. We thought it was just black dick. But I guarantee you what it had. But you put it in. 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 What was the first artist she went to? I went to Tampa Tony and I went to Tay Mac. But what I'm saying is, when you was explaining that, you was like, the lyrics was so. You made them like that was deep. They was deep. I'm like, no, the words are at the head. That's what he was saying. I'm not saying the song was deep. He said, Tico, turn the lights off. When you don't pay your bill, they turn the lights off. I'm saying what he said was so catchy, like. It, it was catchy. It was catchy. That's the only thing that a person that ain't from Tampa with nobody. Where Tico is. It was no, because if you go to St. Pete, it's not the It's not. It wasn't was the you, wordplay. I'm tell you. It was. It was the beat and make. I'm gonna say right. this because we because we made the beat too like really like 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 But the, the song was so popular. I was in Atlanta when it first came out, and I had a guy when I tell him I was Tampa. What's up with the boy Take Baby? Keep me in the song every on the radio, and that's just how big that regular record that was recorded in the bathroom or wherever they recorded it at. That's how big it took off. It was in a whole other state. It was that big. But that's when you get to get out there, but that boy can actually speak. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm not taking that to the and I know he can speak because I've seen a lot of lives right. with him spit. But when Willie was describing the song, to me, it was like he was describing the blueprint on the <laughs> same <laughs> thing. about teasing with a tip. We heard that project. Yeah. Okay, like, <laughs> teasing with the tip. <laughs> the teasing with the tip project come out followed by the great sweatpants project. Oh, wow. I don't you to be trying to act like you back me and I managed. Damn. Okay. I let the guy go listen to y'all. Okay. You, you. Matter of fact, right now we gotta fire you on here. That's fine. I guess so, we gotta put an L. He fired on that. So, so what? 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 what, what you the most when you first, when you first met Trio, you know you first got in the studio. What? What was going through your mind when you heard her with that industry beat? Like, boy, she just don't know I got something for it. You asked him a question, don't answer. It's so crazy you asked that question because it's I remembered exactly the first time I heard her like spit. And by the time that session was done, I told her she didn't have to pay me. I gotta work with her. Wow. Yeah. I I, I, didn't, I didn't have done that's crazy. That's wow. dope. That's dope. That's dope. <laughs> yeah, that's dope. Yeah, she's just dope, man. She uh it's just a uh, her her flow game and, 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 and rhyme scheme is just it's unheard of right now as far as right. you know you don't hear yep. like yep. right. you know you hear a lot of stuff like the uh, you know just, you know yeah y'all know the shit y'all I don't want to call nobody don't want to call nobody out but y'all know that shit y'all I know that shit y'all Hey, look, we get, we get the drip. We ain't no. calling nobody out. That, that shit's too old. We talking about this new shit. Oh, oh, oh. That ain't gonna be squad on it. Listen. Squad on it. Because if they respond back to Trina and Boss, she'll show everyone on the show. So stop. 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 Twitter. 
I don't want to go on there either. Uh-huh. Please stand. Uh-huh. You gotta connect them so everything you put yeah, on yeah, Facebook yeah. and all that shit. Yeah, I know. Exactly. I'm trying to get a little better with the social media stuff, but my phone's too big. All right. All right. So I don't know. It's right. too much to look at. I feel it. I get time for some. Listen, Lawson, we gotta bring you back because you do yeah. the whole show. You not a, you not. I mean, we glad we brought your pick out a chance to talk to you, but we need to sit down and talk to you. We got before you leave here, we're gonna get you on. We got a thousand questions. We got a thousand because you know what? We we really never had a producer engineer come and sit down with the team and talk about that side of the fence. So that'll be a dope interview. That's when to bring you back and talk about the other side of the fence because we always get the artist perspective and stuff like that. And we get other people and stuff like that, but we want to talk about female. We had a couple of years. Yeah, because Keith, Keith, yeah. Keith, 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 open up like how Vince will open up. Okay, so you yeah. know, but we want to not no no disrespect to my boy. We Mito. love you, Mito. Does Mito make us some fire tracks for yeah, Mito. Mito makes some fire tracks. Yeah. He's Yo. definitely making noise in the in the in Tampa. But listen, we ran out of time. And listen. Wait. What's Wait. up? Lava, what we gonna find you at? Lava, what we gonna find you at? Uh, pretty much, uh, I'm kind of like Trigger. It's just uh, pretty much Instagram. Uh, <laughs> but, uh, all Facebook, Facebook, you can uh, go on the Lava Pit uh, recording studio. Uh, okay. And, uh, Where the recording studio at? Uh, it's actually in, based in uh, Temple Terrace, uh, Florida. Google him. Uh, yep, pretty yeah, much. Cool uh, him. Google him. Yeah, yeah, cool him. Go on Instagram and go to book underscore Lava. Can I get an address? He don't, he don't me, want motherfuckers to show up. Yeah, it's, it's a point in the only. It's a point in the only. Hey, thank you for trying to record that song with your friend, too, you know. That's what he did on the information. Oh, yeah, yeah. You might do too. Tease him with your tail. That shit going to win. All right, so listen, when you hang out, okay, first of all, we got a t shirt with my girl down there. But listen. When you hang out with the love, lust, and sex team, you gotta leave your morals at the motherfucking door. Listen, we out. On that note, we out of here. All right. Damn. So, Rock, take us out to me.